13 Action News Update, sponsored by Silver State Schools Credit Union. I'm Kalina Estrinos, and right now in your 13 Action News Update, about 18,000 MGM Resort employees will lose their jobs on Monday. That's according to a letter sent this morning by CEO Bill Hornbuckle. Right now, it's unclear how many employees right here in Las Vegas will be impacted, but most, but not all of the MGM Resort properties have reopened in Las Vegas. Experiencing technical difficulties, the Nevada Department of Employment says its PUA site is operating at slower speeds. So users, you might be seeing slow response times. Dieter says it's working with the vendor to address the issue. So far, there's no estimate for when the site will be back to normal. And the Golden Knights will be back on the ice tomorrow night. Their game against the Vancouver Canucks starts at 645. This matchup, it was rescheduled after the NHL postponed last night's and tonight's games to take a stand for social justice. We are battling the heat as we head into the weekend. 106 on your Friday afternoon here in Las Vegas could get as hot as 108 upon the north end of the valley. So the heat marches on. We are talking about temperatures for your Friday evening just slowly falling down through the 90s with overnight lows around 82 degrees here in the city. Now we do anticipate more comfortable nights next week. We'll wake up to the 70s starting Monday morning. A little breezy through the weekend, Kalina. It will actually turn a bit humid Saturday, Sunday, and Monday, so there might be a stray storm over the mountains by Sunday afternoon. We think, though, our temperatures here in the city will drop close to 100 early next week. All right, Justin, thank you so much. And that was your 13 Action News update. You can find more on our website, ktv.com, and our free mobile app.